Uh, Ziprint is essentially a tech-enabled brokerage uh, in the property management space. Uh, we are a broker of record in every state that we operate, currently um, five different states. You can see that under areas of service on our website. But also, um, we have a completely homebrewed software, which keeps track of the entire life cycle of a property during property management and automates a lot of it as our staff help the owner navigate the different stages of that property's uh, management. Uh, we'll dive right in and kind of show you the, the website. We charge $125 a month for property management and uh, $1,250 for tenant placement. That's part of our MO is, you know, straightforward. Uh, we don't have long-term contracts. We're essentially kind of trying to differentiate ourselves from the mom and pop property management companies, but also add so much value so that someone who's considering a SaaS software for them to manage the property themselves, they'll come to us because for a little bit more, they're going to get essentially that brokerage level expertise uh, without having to pay for it. Uh, in terms of inefficiency with mom and pop, as well as the, the higher costs, obviously. Um, you can see that um, under our About Us page, uh, this, this comes directly from our database. We have 2,200 plus units under management. We've placed 3,300 units uh, tenants to date. Uh, that's over the last three years or so since 2019. Um, we've, you know, throughout that process, we've placed uh, these number of tenants. We've done a lot of on-demand showings, which is what we call with our smart lock boxes, as well as the repairs that we've coordinated. But we are a full on property management firm, so we handle the entire life cycle, as well as rent collection. To use uh, a property as an example and to show you guys our dashboard, this dashboard is what a manager sees, but also you know owners are going to see a similar view without as much um, access. Uh, here, here's a property that we've been managing for some time, and uh, this property uh, was recently listed, so it has some recent data uh, that we can dive in through. Um, under uh, leads, you're going to find the leads that we got from different sources. Uh, Zillow is a large lead source in our industry, but also, you know, for example, rentals.com and apartments.com. We actually parse those emails, get the name, phone number, and start communicating with those prospects to try and get them through the process and get the get them to sign a lease. Um, we push them through our to our showing page. In this case, this would be the showing page for this property. The photos are all, are all professionally taken by us. Um, since this property just had a tenant place, we don't have a showing schedule, but you would see a schedule here. Generally, it's any day, any time, because we have a smart lockbox there. On the showings page, you're going to see who's scheduled, both the owner and the, and the manager, as well as uh, what the what the lockbox code for that person is. We also run through some fraud analysis on our side to make sure that it's a legitimate person. The proximity is, is all right for someone who wants to see a property like this. They're not in New York trying to schedule a showing here in California, etc. cetera. Uh, once they see a property, our goal is to essentially use um, automated notifications to push them towards the application process. And once the application is completed, our system actually goes through and uh, does some automated income analysis and credit checks to try and qualify that applicant. We have a proprietary zip score um, that we describe to the owners um, and we use that zip score to make recommendations to the owners to move forward. Uh, once an owner wants to move forward with uh, a tenant, we essentially generate the lease. Our, our system automatically generates the lease based off of custom parameters that the owner wants, um, some things that we need to put legally from a jurisdiction perspective, city of Mountain View, state of California, um, and also um, some of the things that uh, we specifically put uh, in leases depending on the type of property that it is, home, apartment, etc. cetera. Uh, these are all automatically generated, sent to the owner for approval. Owner approves it, tenant goes ahead and signs it, and then we collect a secure deposit. But one of the things that's unique about us is that we don't really touch the money um, from the perspective of rent and secure deposit. So you're going to find that anything that you see on the rent, it's money that's moved from tenants to the owners directly. That keeps us uh, away from any sort of um, fund control that, that brokers are often uh, accustomed to. And then same thing with repairs. When we coordinate a repair, you know, the money goes from the owner to the tenant. We do all the work and a lot of that is also automated from the perspective of taking in the work order and submitting it to the 